good morning we are like frantically trying to rush to school because come to find out they don't start school tomorrow the paper that the school sent out had the wrong date so meanwhile we're sitting here sleeping and some told me i told london last night that she started school tomorrow because she wouldn't go to sleep so and then i'm like oh i should do your hair like since you up and jody had me sleeping on the couch anyway so i'm like no whatever go ahead you still got a whole day um she don't have a whole day because her school called me this morning and asking me where she was i still um i still have time to get her there i guess it's like nine o'clock they don't got school till two something so she's not missing like a horrible like amount of time but I just wish she wasn't late. Like, I wish I woke up one time and was, like, doing this proper uh, like I would have done tomorrow. I have my alarm already set for tomorrow to wake up in the morning and all of that at 6 o'clock. <sighs> but she back there. She dressed. She actually ready to go to school. You ready? Huh? You excited? make some friends all right so yeah now we have to hurry up and get down here i ain't gonna take no pictures i ain't gonna do her hair her lunch is rushed i didn't even oh my god y'all you love counting to five sorry the camera all shaky i'm trying to do this with my other hand you all excited Just a little bit excited. Yeah. Well, you finally made it, big girl. Hmm. Okay. Jody, of course, is upset because that's what he does. He hates her going to sleep. Um, but I had to drop off the paperwork for her grants so she can go to school because your girl can't afford that. Um. So I had them. I went in the office and then they took her down because just like her other school, they are very strict on parents staying at the school um, and like walking into the classrooms and things like that because it, for a lot of kids, for a lot of kids, it makes them cry more, which, let me pop y'all up. Can I pop y'all up? No, I can't. But for a lot of kids, it makes them cry more if the parent takes them to the classroom and then leaves them there. So I dropped her off in the office. Her teacher met us there. And, um, I know. I know you're going to go to school really soon, okay? So, I'm so mad. Atlanta took off tomorrow um, so he could like, bring her to school with me. Oh, her birthday at school was not supposed to be this hectic at all. It was supposed to be like perfect, go smoothly. <sighs> I'm telling y'all. Um, I know, Big Daddy. I know. So, but she in there. She's at school. I'm sure she'll do great. She uh. It's at a whole new school, so she doesn't have the comfort of her cousins there this year. So she'll be forced to make new friends, which is nice. Because last year she stuck to only playing with her cousins for the first like couple of weeks. She didn't really care about making friends. But um I want her to make friends. Which she always ends up doing. But y'all know London is stuck in her shell. She is very secluded and shy so i want her to um be forced to branch out and interact with other kids make friends and all of that so but she's also easily hurt so my fear is that she's gonna make these friends and then a lot of kids aren't like london london will play with you no matter what all the time you're her friend she's never gonna hurt your feelings well, not all kids are like that. Sometimes other kids play with other friends and then they don't want to play with her and that hurts her feelings like tremendously. So, hopefully kindergarten is the year 
that she um, realizes that that's just how life is and that she can't always have the same friends and that all her friends aren't only going to play with her and that some of their friends might not want to play with her and that's okay too. I, I called everybody. I called Landon. Like like I said, he called off. Well, he didn't call off. But he got tomorrow off to take her to school and it ain't even the first day of school, but we still gonna vlog and we're gonna wake her up and I'm gonna do all of tomorrow's video as if it's the first day of school. So just fair warning. When y'all confused, like I thought she already started to school. Yes, yeah, she got two first days. He got all on feet. <laughs> London came home and passed out. She only had four hours of sleep before we got the call that school started today. So, but it's time to wake up. Wake up. Wake up. It's time to wake up, big girl. You get to go back to sleep in a few more hours, okay? Let's go. Where did I go? How was school? Tell the vlog how school was. Tell the vlog how you enjoy school. I go. Hmm. I go. Hmm. I go. I how was school? I go. Did you have fun today? You didn't? You told me you had fun. What's your teacher name? Oh. What's your teacher name? What's your teacher name? Huh? Y'all there. Y'all know who I was back in the day. As soon as you come home, you gotta take that uniform off. How's school? Miss what? Miss what? Miss what? Why do you look like that? Look at your face. Look at your face. Look at your face. That I look love. Yeah. Yeah. Your teacher name is Mock. Did you make? Hey. Hey. Jody jumping in that bed. Aww. Aww. I want to get him a new bed. A big boy bed. Don't you want Jody to have a big boy bed? Huh? I really want to get this bed from Ikea. I put a picture right here. Let me move my head over so the picture can go right here. I want that bed simply because London have her bed and I can put Joe bed underneath for now and then like she'll have her, you know, like uh like a what's the loft style bed where she, you know, get her own room. And um that's really what I wanna do. Grandma downstairs.
I gotta get London up for school. Oh, yeah, huh? Yeah, huh? Yes, huh? Yes. You want to drink it? Drink it. What you want to drink? You just want to talk with me? Okay. Okay, come on. You want a lot of stuff. She gonna make you chocolate milk. Chocolate milk. Okay. I don't want to. Uh -huh. Good morning. She got a little dress. Good morning. It's our proper first day of school. It's the second day of school. Chocolate milk. Come on. Jolly sandwich. Yes. Um. Everybody move their car. I'm making a. I made her lunch pretty much. Ooh. Turn around. Why you got this on eight and you going to move cars? I thought I'd be burning some sausage up. cook on eight and you moving cars i don't even know what the call is no more you can't even tell it's blending in with the pan at least you moved our car for us thank you um i told y'all i was gonna have my life together on the real first day because today was technically supposed to be her first day according to the letter that the school sent you out it was supposed to be the 17th, which is today. But um, I already got her lunch together. So I can move grandma's teacup. I already got her lunch here, pretty, pretty much pre-packed. Um, all I gotta do is make the sandwich. So, plus her faves, tomato, cucumber. I pre-packaged um, like little raisin cups in our snack bucket y'all know i got like our little snack thing where i normally have pretzels peanut butter and stuff like that um well i got her some like little raisin cups and stuff so i'm gonna go ahead and make her sandwich go ahead and get her sandwich going so we can get the dice moving i found these little bagel things since she likes the raisin bread um this is just it's basically the same thing So that's what I got. <laughs>
home is recorded on two separate tracks, each one giving special emphasis to certain sections of the orchestra, as heard from those positions. Now, when played back simultaneously on two separate systems, the sounds are blended together to achieve a new dimension in sound, impossible to obtain in a monoro recording. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There it goes. That's all she got today. Get your bubble. Sorry, Sorry. Uh, I know that big old bus and cars coming. Oh. I'm not gonna take you in. I'm just gonna take you right here. Here, you gonna put it on? Remember your lunch is in there, okay? Okay. Okay, go ahead so you can eat breakfast. <laughs> 